Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. While you can create a table in Datasheet view, it is not recommended. It is a poor place to design tables due to its lack of control over the data types that are assigned to the fields and its complete inability to change the properties of fields. If you do decide to create a table in Datasheet view, you should certainly view the table in Design View at some point to ensure that it's correctly constructed. Some people like to start in Datasheet View because they feel more familiar with the table layout that is shown in the Datasheet View. If you are migrating to Access from a spreadsheet program like Excel, this may be the case for you as well. Datasheet View is for adding, editing, and deleting data records within a table. To open a table that you have created in Datasheet View, double-click the name of the table that you want to open from the table list that is shown in the navigation pane. Alternately, you can select the name of a table that you want to open within the navigation pane, and then press the Enter key on your keyboard to open it in Datasheet View as well. When you open a table in Datasheet View, the fields are the columns that are displayed across the top of the table from left to right. The records are contained in the rows from top to bottom. You can view multiple records at a time in Datasheet View. The record and field headings for the active cell, where data entry will occur, are highlighted in orange for ease of visibility. The active record is highlighted blue. The active cell is colored with a red border. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.